Hey, this is Heather from the Renaissance English History Podcast, and this is your Tudor Minute for February the 22nd. Today in 1511, Henry VIII and Catherine of Aragon's son, Henry, Duke of Cornwall, died at just 52 days old. He was the heir that Henry needed, and both parents were devastated when they heard. No one knows exactly what killed Henry. It might have been SIDS, but it was tragic for Henry and Catherine. Henry tried to comfort Catherine as best as he could. They arranged a funeral filled with all of the honors for Prince. The king and queen didn't go to the funeral, as was customary, as to not attract attention away from the prince. But he was buried in Westminster Abbey, carried in a small, tiny coffin from Richmond Palace to the river, where it was brought up the river in a convoy of three barges. 180 paupers were paid to pray for the soul of the baby Henry. Henry VIII and Catherine were still young enough to have more children, though of course they would only have Mary, and it would be 26 years before Henry would have another son. That's your Tudor Minute for today. Remember, you can dive deeper into life in 16th century England through the Renaissance English History Podcast at englandcast.com.